um, over-glorified support at the moment. That also fell out of uh, favor for most supports. Uh oh. Smoking. Uh oh. Focus Fail. got the stun! <laughs> they all lined up. Still Ari's don't. Still do That is stun. Are you serious? How does it actually work for OG? They run into a high ground. Five man, no spike. Who cares? They got a bunch of AoE spells as well. Goes for the Pango, maybe a little bit more defensive. Uh, one difference for me is maybe JT. Okay. Magnus, skewer back. Skewer tomato. It's out of range pretty Actually, quickly. Now look at the minus armor. A lot of damage onto Popoka. Maybe the illusion. Oh, they got him in the end. JT is still striking back onto Tomato. Maybe Seb now. It's a bunch of the creeps. Oh, oh. oh sir, that was a. Uh... Oh, no, no, Ooh. no. Come to JT. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, dude. What did they just do? Seb, by the way, took, like, that Dark Troll Summoner ripped him a new one, like, he was constantly right in the mid lane. Can we get the kill on Pango? A nice shield crash from BZM, maybe the turn's gonna be there on Super Boko. Lines up the Swashbuckle as well, so nothing to say. A little bit low, all up in a couple of seconds. We'll be on the mark. Pench is still in the water room as well, but Nova snipes him. Huh, interesting early game. I mean, it, <laughs> I'll go. Radiant structures are fortified. Top lane. They are diving a bit, but I'm not sure. This is a bit too deep. Venge, Seb is rotating in, though. I would decree where they should be able to go for Xnova. Don't they go on Tomato as well, though? Let's see. Xnova. Making him work for the kill, but Sir Wisp has got multiple rounds of spells to be able to use. But Boko's going to try and TP him, but I don't know if you've got to stop Whisper. Ari's got a, I mean, no real spells he can chuck out. Just one more sticky bomb. But Whisper's still got plenty of mana. But Boko's going to try and drain him. Nice chain. Drops the branch. Yeah. All right. So oh, there was some discussion going on. Because... Four. Maybe take some confidence away, because... Like he is just bodying the bottom lane. Nothing to say with the rotation. Tomato's got a big wand along with healing Lotus. They might just look for the kill into Seb instead. Yeah, but R is rotating. Even Pango starting to come through the river as well. Nice shockwave. So it cancels the blast off, but yeah, it's unfortunately taking a little bit too long for them to guarantee these kills, and now they're worried about the Pango rotation. Here I am. Yeah, they felt no way, look at BZM. Okay, I mean, Pupoka's gonna die, but... I mean, this is a this is a big kill. BZM just solo kills him. Oh my god, that incredible read, BZM. Doesn't kill the Venge, doesn't kill the Timado, TB, and now your tier 1 tower is... Uh, maybe not gonna fall, they have RP, JT's going in. Pupoka, unfortunately, very close to level 6. Not just yet, but yeah, JT's gonna be forced to drop the RT, RP, and X Nova. Is it all Let's see. The smoke up top. They know where Monet is. This is basically where every Luna is at this point. That's right from X over there. I don't know if it's gonna matter in the end. Monet will stop the rolling thunder short. They've still got the oh, that's actually but bad. the shield crash beforehand. They're gonna be able to get some big return kills. Have they got the damage for Whisper though? All the control. Whisper's gonna be able to get some separation. Wait, doesn't okay. that grip actually kill him? The Luna a little bit faster at least. Sep. Going on him. No chance to wave terror. Maybe he can do it now at least. With a little bit of damage mitigation, but won't really help him. I, I, I felt like the grip catches. Of course, he did use a shield crash before, that's true. Can they kill him top? There's no grip now. They have RP though. Oh, can they? They got finger. There's finger as well. Yeah, they should be. I don't. Oh, let's there see. Okay. Come on. Okay. Come okay. On. Okay. <laughs> oops, oops. No. Look no one fight. should survive RP on a finger at this point. <laughs> this stun. Yeah, even just doing the twin gate minute eight to ten and moving on the enemy carry mid lane. BZM. Big one. Very aggressive position from BZM. I mean, the remnants of the T1 tower, G2IG, they're going to be able to respond. BZM is tanky with the shield crash, but. It should still go down. Oh, the 
just gets the, the uh, spike off my friend. No impale. Wrong hero. It's okay, though. I'll let it slide. Don't make that mistake it's, again. It, it, oh, he's living life. With this smoke, if they if they scout to Tomato, he's gone. Yeah, he's gone. Finger up. They know. They know. Ta -dum. Ta -dum. Ta -dum. Ta -dum. They're coming. Oh, they use Fiend's group. Maybe the opportunity for a sunder. Oh! <laughs> okay. Where did you go? Let's see if he's going to continue farming this, which he will. They have a ward to drop. They don't. Seb could maybe. Oh, they will drop the ward. They, have they might need to try and swap him back. They won't. Sorry. Nice kill. Very good read. <laughs> Carry on one side, I carry It's not a gigantic lead at all for G2IG. In fact, it's under a thousand. But do you feel like OG need to be kind of concerned with how much farm Puck has gotten? Actually, well, that JT. That's your scepter. Yeah, and now he's stuck. Might be able to get an RP off if they're thinking about even fighting afterwards, but G2IG are already retreating back to their side. Uh, he makes my. He makes my answer much easier. If JT is dead and they catch him like this, then it doesn't really matter. Little tower is under attack. You should be reading this, right? Like, you know how Luna drafts play Boca. Do they want to fight? I mean, if they catch some heroes onto the back line, potentially. G2 IG are hunting. They won't intercept anyone before they actually group together on OG. They are still trying to play on the on the retreat. Maybe BZM's going to run into them. Or Seb. So both. Nothing to say. Gets a start. Oh, nice sleep. Nice, nice sleep. nightmare into the uh, grip as well. Now it's going to be able to set up for the RP. That's beautiful from X Nova. But still, the response is going to be there from OG. Whisper will be uncontested inside the team fight, and that spells issues for OG. Yules. Yules is there to cancel the teleport, and JT ripped apart as well. It's a little bit weaker at taking it, but Luna's always not the worst. No, both teams, I feel like they take it fairly easily. Luna. Get scouted by the mines, Nova. Oh, Whisper. Is this a fight you want to take now? Whisper. Maybe with Eclipse damage, look at the burst potential. Okay. Whisper's gone. And now with the call on the back line, nothing to say is an arcane rune inside the team fight. We already said Puck's going to be an issue for them, but now with his extra benefit, it could be even more difficult. Nothing to say. Looking to try and JT. utilize as best as he can because JT's hit already. RP onto one, but it's a great target. They'll get rid of all the control on OG. And now Seb's going to be run down as well. Tomato's thinking about entering, but can Tomato really fight? X Nova's still got the Fiend's grip. Are they going to have the damage to be able to bring him down through the control? They want to deal with everyone else before Tomato. Monade's going to be able to re-enter. And Ari, he's just got no stun. Joe Blade stuck on the high ground regardless. Blown up full to zero. And Ari will be chased down as well. A full five man wipe as G2IG. Taking in so, uh, he, he could not counter uh, when they jumped Whisper, so he had to retreat back to the high ground, and even then he only had like half health when they jumped them as well, so no resources an issue. But they're gonna try and take the fight with ultimates down, but RP's actually back up though. And still no meta for 10. What oh, Monet? It's just gonna walk in BKB. Walking in. Standing strong enough to Mato. He just snatched the ages to Mato. He doesn't have his own BKB. JT finds a beautiful angle. The RP is just the icing on the cake. Yeah, he's really big as well. And this is a hero that's a problem for Terrible. A ton of magic damage. This was caught. It's just another death. I mean, it was having such an exceptional start to the game, but... <laughs> it's something. Um, I don't know. He's buying this BKB and he will need it, even though he's... Is he on bottoms game. underneath the ward? JT's yeah, gonna be able to catch him and nothing to say he's here as well. <laughs> did Great he vision. buy Blink? He did, right? He bought out. Yeah. I think he has it, so. Pumping from X Nova. Not to say he's going to be able to reconnect with the boots of travel. They'll lose the Bane. But now with the coil landing on to two, Monade's going to be able to enter into the team fight. BKB Eclipse up, ready to go. They're just running Tomato down because they know he's got no Sunder. So once the health is gone, he's not going to get it back up a second time. Whisper. All right. This might be a wipe. He has Yules. That's not going to matter. Uh, Blink up. Just... They'll stop it. <laughs> He just bought him a little bit of extra time. Monet actually losing the ages here.
But only Pango is up. If you lose this tower, you are losing the rest. Oh, they're jumping him. Alright. Bye bye. Not to death. Oh, it's a lot of damage from Wispa. He might just die though. Wispa. They're gonna be able to chase him. It's a die back. It looked cool. Traveled. You got the kill, but. <laughs> I mean, nothing to say. He's just. He's. Oh, okay. Swaps there from Seb. They're coming though. All of IG are ready. Double damage rune on Monate. <laughs> the claves and nothing to say. Still gonna be able to catch up to Tomato. He won't even be able to get the Sunder off. All the hate. RPUs. No buyback for him. You got creeps as well in the mid. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Radiant's middle tower has fallen. Your Radiant's timber is still dead for 15. Guys. And a hex, yeah. He's so farmed as well, like he can... I right, can go yours if you want. You can really just argue with BKB this stage. He caught him. It's... Alright, roll in. Oh, BZM jumped over them though. And now nothing to say, he's just creating way too much chaos on the back line. Seb at least will be able to cancel the Fiend's group. So BZM with the remnant to the Rolling Thunder secures Not the kill. Bad. But Tomato is starting to come. He's a little bit too late though to, to get there at the start of the fight and... Whisper's still gonna be killed off nonetheless. Nothing to say. It's just there's nothing, nothing at all. This park has to be concerned at. You get Techies is up in five seconds, but what can you possibly do here? Look at that horn toss out of the fountain. No hiding in the fountain, friend. Uh, RP unused. Yeah. We go next. The uh, mental reset for OG. Good lane start. Solid early game. Uh, just execution though from G2IG. Couple be pretty. Look, I haven't seen this matchup for a while, but I know it was quite razor favored in the past. And TA used to have to go play jungle on on the early levels. I'm not sure if it's any different. I imagine it's kind of similar though. Oh, oh damn, that's a good one. 10 and 2, where Razor is really dominating mid at the moment. Yeah, and there's just kill threat in all the lanes. Top lane, if X Nova is mainly able to get on top of the Rubik. There's a little bit more difficult with the Telekinesis. Bottom, though. Snipe down. Okay, well done. Poboka with the Earth Spike. JT as well, two points up in the Axes. Poboka, looking rough bottom. once again. Are OG going to be able to get a kill? Hopefully Tomato's going to be able to find it, giving some injection of gold. We'll have to use the blood grenade. Nice stun at least before he dies. I thought there might be contested stacks. But they probably would start to drop some vision down. x has got one ward. They are also both backstabbing OG. Yeah, maybe with the beast they can do it, right? Like just spamming axes. So... A little bit of trouble here. Once Monade's able to get on top of him, those two points rocket barrage. They'll deal with the cogs, but it's not going to matter. G2IG, nice kill for them considering you know, Whisper was off to a pretty decent start. 29-7. They're going to be able to slip through Master though. Yeah, considering they even got that kill, right? Like they got that kill early, bottom early on Ari. Nice sleep. Stepped up way too far. I had your support leaving the lane. And a good read though from Tomato instantly ping out. Seb started to move down. Oh, another kill for them. Okay, making a slight comeback. Not to say actually using the shield on going top. Boca. The Boca's gonna die, but uh, Whisper just has to commit to it because there's no way he's gonna be able to escape as well once nothing to say is locked on. It's a play. It's not a great play, but it's a play. And it's a play that looks like will work though, but Boca. Hugging the trees. They're going to see the trap shortly. Still go off. They're going to turn to Baboka and said Maybe they can also get JT. It's a little bit split with their decisions, though. Ari is here, though. With Ari being here, they're going to be able to run into JT inside the tree line. And you're happy with Baboka that. Baboka slips away, but yeah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, you're super, super happy with that. You you got to rotation in. The only problem is the top lane. Like, you're losing this tier 1 tower. Nothing to say also rotated in. Uh, and more importantly, Whisper was zoned out of some of the experience. 
Losing the tier 1 tower top lane like this is... Got a pretty fat magic wand, but... With a good split, and Seb being 6 here, yeah. Should be able to get him. And they will, no TPs. Alright, well done. Big kill, very big kill. You're gonna be able to get the carry out of IG. Second in net worth. Uh, unfortunately, their tower taking ability is a bit limited. Maybe that's where Tomato is going to be able to come into play. I like this rotation as well from the Wolf thing. So, exactly what they need out of OG. Yep. With the Morphling. Broken mid lane might also die. Okay. I kind of. Uh, they're going to put a lot of pressure on bottom. Once they open up the tower, JT can go back and farm the stacks. Fortunately, no hook shot just yet from X Nova. Tomato might Tomato. be able to get enough distance away to waveform TP out. Oh. oh, I think What's it's taking a bit too long now. Yeah, I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, oops. You know what happened? What, I, I, at least what my theory is. He was trying to get next to Rosh to waveform over. But then he right clicked Rosh. And then his hero started attacking instead of running behind him. I think he just misclicked. That's how it looked like, I might be wrong. Mid lane, nothing to say. There is no way, right? Like, Ari is coming from behind. He's got 16 Maybe. more Maybe. Alright. BZM shredding people. Monet as well now. Trap one, trap two. XO will wrap around. Monade's still taking a lot of damage. Fiend's Crypt's gonna be cancelled. Now with the roar as well from JT, they've locked the tier inside the cogs and kept Monade alive. So the main damage source can start. Oh, um, whisper. Oh. Nice scan, and he's down through the with the portal. Whisper. Monade's gonna try and tip out, but he'll cancel it. Oh, Whisper's doing some good stuff this game. So you know, it doesn't have the net worth to represent it. But Wait, very well done. what did he buy? What did he buy if he doesn't have the net worth? Because he just had like 2.6k gold. And then Gyro, he gets Helm of Overlord. He becomes even... Uh, an even bigger issue. But clockwork, hookshot mid. This team is gone. I, I think Gyro is also fine. I wouldn't mind one or the other. Gyro getting Agrims, getting like X, crit, BKB is his timing. timing. Beast is... He's taken over the map anyway. Look at Seb. <laughs> nice Free bait kill for by Seb. JT. Yeah, yeah. Nice bait by JT. I don't know if you noticed. He was pumping Roar and then he threw Axes instead. Just so Ari doesn't steal Roar. He has to buy it. You're playing into line. We're playing into most... Most importantly, of course. Beast Master with the Roar. Easy yeah. Nova. Yeah, okay. I mean, he wanted 50. the stacks, so that's why they kept. They, they were just baiting the Templar assassin, ready for him to walk <laughs> up the high ground. Oh, Jesus, he almost got Boboko. And JT will take him. Like, you weren't happy with JT not getting any stacks. He's going to share them now with uh, Overlord. You have uh, Manta on Razor. You have a way to initiate with Lion as well. Boboko has a blink once again. Nova's in. Oak shot in, X Nova. Is going to be able to find it a great angle with the double earth spike as well. Also clips onto Sep to prevent the Whisper. nightmare. Now the roar. Oh, it's just disastrous. All the spell casting again. Similar to game one. G2 IG connecting with all their spells. Desso though, they will flare. This is a bit sketchy. You might have to preemptively split. Same place like in the last game. Once again, Sep. And nothing to say, he's going to be able to lock onto BZM. So he'll be able to drain away the damage of the Templar Assassin. Roar as well is just going to bring him down to start the fight. Tomato needs to go huge, but he just doesn't have the net worth. And Whisper is gone. Dies with the Brulings. Tomato's going to be chased down. A good TP location, but Ari as well tries to duck into the pit. G2IG spy him out. Just another great fight for Dyer. Game that started fine though like yo i know whisper was a little bit behind in net worth but i thought his rotations were great and well Ari's gonna get caught x nova's clockwork has been three zero on and point. two yeah on point 15 out of the 17 kills 14 out of the 17 from the poker 
support to just making stuff happen this game. This is and, and they without a doubt have done that. BZM, they're now setting up on him and... Uh, Pavoke is going to be able to get the Hex before the Blink to respond. It's just the supports. Are they going to be able to kill like him? Yep. Oh, oh no, just got the refraction up at the last second. Now OG have responded. Almost everyone has come over, so Beast to to fly away. <laughs> jumps back in. I love how he tried to fly away, you know, nothing is... Everything is clean, and when everything is clean, it's either you're a god gamer, or the enemy team is just not ready ever. And I feel like it's a bit of both. G2 IGR, great, bot lane. But finally, they're showing some cracks in the armor. Like, they managed to kill the Razor, the clock on top lane as well. I will be caught. You are very, very happy with that exchange. They might also get the Helm of the Overlord creep inside the base, unless JT can... Dominate this range creep, yeah. He dominates Satanic, I believe, yeah. Completed on nothing to say as well now. Jump in. That's four stuff. Oh, nice great nightmare from Seb. Still look at the damage! Before the BKB responds, BZM's gonna get it off for the last second. Monet's in some danger, but with the Satanic activated, he's gonna be okay. Tomato creating chaos in the back line. He just doesn't have enough took items. took a lot of damage. He no stole a lot of damage. No right damage to be able to kill them. Maybe with the Static Link, it's gonna be enough for the end. Waveform over the top. All the attention Nicely put on Monet. Done. They get a big kill. Can OG get more though? They get a glimpse of JT trying to retreat to the east. And OG will get another very good fight. Some big sleeps. Great. You're disengaged as well, Ari, with the four stops, the glimpse. Clutch. Yeah, he still this didn't dodge actually. Like finger of that, right? The finger of that still went whisper. Yeah. With he's the tanky. finger and the. He is tanky. But well, Boku goes full drain instead. They're coming though. And they're going to be able to. They stole raw! Oh, they're back. Still though, X Nova smoked up. Still a pretty big clockwork. JT, Smoke's gonna pop inside the trap. This monster would be a great pick up the stuff, but Broker's gonna be in before the split! Have they got the damage double four stuff? Whisper's okay. Once again, the support's coming huge inside the team fight. JT's gonna be able to hold the Templar Assassin down with the roar, but Tomato, he's soaking all the damage. Now the Fiend's gift from Seb, yeah. They've woken up. OG, now the spell casting is there from them. The response with the jump back onto nothing to say. He's down in a heartbeat. The Boca will escape, but I mean, just a double force from them. You save on the initiation. Whisper gets the split off. They get one delivered. Radiance middle tower is under attack. How do they find the angle? Whisper just aggressive charging from the brew. Instant primal split. And what's the call? How are they going to be able to enter the fight off the back of this as well? They want to try and deal with the supports, Tomato. Early peek at me from Pavoka. Pavoka's dancing around the trees. They don't get a clean kill. It's messy. And it's not good enough. Whisper is They'll dead. lose the Brewmaster. And now nothing to say. Back. Great Hurricane Pike. BZM's going to be able to get out of range of the Static Link. Radiance Middle Tower is under attack. Nothing to say. Aggressive charge in Pavoka as well. It's going to be able to find the Hex. Do they Mado. have the damage? Double four stuff again into the nightmare. Tomorrow's okay. Now it just blows up the clockwork. BZM wants to turn. They've got a fiend script as well. Someone needs to cancel it. Does anyone have a stun? They do not. A little bit too late from Baboka. Monet's going to try and run in, but this is tomorrow's fight along with BZM's to win it all. They're buying back on G2IG, but they just do not have enough left. The stolen Earth Spike connects onto two. And OG. They're going to be able to catch up to X Nova as well. Unfortunately, there will be a TP out from JT, but Roche will be theirs now. Yeah, be base though. They like want said, to catch them because of bot, bot right? Hitting the melee barracks is going to nothing. Jesus, big meld. Right. G2 IG doing a really good job at, at kiting this fight. Whisper's going to be able to play around with the Primal Split. Nothing to say, trying to get to the back line. Instantly set with the Fiend Script, but it's cancelled. It might not matter in the end. The damage from BZM, he doesn't care about the Static Link. So you're taking the fight minus the Razor. And Monet, he's just so hesitant. Jaro doesn't feel comfortable running into the middle. 
And it means that JT just, just has no damage to back him up, and Seb Sleep completely takes Monet out of the equation. They did lost, lose the Rexes down bottom, by the way. But will it matter? Maybe they just lose the game here. There, there are three buybacks. All three of them need to. All of them. Yeah, they have to. But you gotta get something. And Seb is just not enough. Maybe JT can catch someone with the raw, but the four stuffs get them out. Some more damage, right? Tomato. Tomato. Broke oh. it. Yeah, they don't know anyone's behind zone. him as well. He's fine. They're starting to come over. Now they're in a really awkward spot, though. Whisper's going to charge in. I mean, Whisper doesn't need to really worry about too much. Tomato's going to get the Jarrah the replica as well. The perfect target for him now with the flat cannon. Tomato should be able to deal with everyone quite easily, but... They've lost Seb, he's been pivotal to the success of the team fights. Not that I say he's gone as well, but still Tomato standing strong in the middle. They just don't have the control. But Boca jumps in too late, but it doesn't matter. And these are cords that have all no buybacks. And now they can chase down the stragglers. x is going to be caught out of the river. You will get the TP away from Boca, but... They're so indecisive, like they can go thrown. They have 20 seconds though, and there is a glyph. Oh, there's a Raper on Tomato. Oh, it's coming out of the corner now. It actually still doesn't have it just yet. Ah, oh, they should kill it too fast. 10 seconds. You just gotta throw bodies. You just gotta throw bodies. It's not gonna matter. They're gonna kite them. Tomato's just gonna avoid them at all costs. See Whispers right clicking the throne as well. And OG 